Alright, so download Blockstrap on their official website. Click on right here and download their the net for Blockstrap to run and I'll put these two in the description. When you run this, it'll automatically download. So when you have these two now, right, uh you can go install the desktop runtime first. So when that's done you can click close and then you can load up Blockstrap. So for here, uh, go to mods, and then scroll down, and enable, disable, full screen optimizations. Go to fast flags, and then you scroll down until you see fast flag editor. And it's going to be a warning, just wait. So click on add new import JSON and I'll have my fast flags linked below they're gonna be in a Google Drive so for example we're gonna use low graphics Just copy all that then you can paste okay sure you want to continue yes yes so once you have that you can go back to fast flags if you wanna edit some settings you can if you want uh, for rendering mode if you have like an old PC or a laptop, you can use Direct 3D10, but overall, uh, you can probably put it to Automatic or Direct 3D11. And you can go click on Install. Install again. So once you guys are done after that, you can go to the search bar and then search up play roblox and go to file open file location and right click open file location versions version and then roblox player beta go to properties compatibility and over here make sure disable full screen optimizations is on then go to change high dpi settings and click on high dpi scaling override run by application ok apply and ok and copy this and then you search up graphics settings and here uh, click on browse and then you paste your roblox pair beta I already have mine so once you have that you can go and click on options high performance and save ok so yeah that is my guide how to download Blockstrap and I hope I made your PC or laptop run a bit faster than it used to be. I'm pretty new here at YouTube and I hope I'll be making more of these videos and Roblox videos in the future. If I helped you guys out, please like and subscribe and see you next time.